Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So I'm posting this video in response to a whole lot of comments I have been seeing on the channel lately regarding the Windows 11 LSA protection bug that's been doing the rounds over the last couple of weeks as I have been posting on. So if you want more info regarding this issue, just do a search on the channel for Windows 11 LSA protection bug. Now, the previous video and last video I did post regarding this problem was that Microsoft had actually confirmed over on their known issues health dashboard page that they had resolved this issue. And as I mentioned in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, um, Microsoft had confirmed back then at the end of April last month that it had fixed this issue with Windows Defender where the local security authority protection is off and was asking for a persistent restart with that warning message as many of you may know by now. And as I mentioned in that video, um, although they had said it was fixed, I was still seeing the warning message to restart my device. Now, um, the latest now is I am still seeing um, comments and um, reports and even videos online where people are saying that this issue has been resolved, including Microsoft, and I'm still going to say otherwise. This is now the third time I'm still saying otherwise. This issue, in my opinion, is not resolved. And my reason for this is because a lot of um, media outlets and even um, people online are saying that if we head to our definition updates, this uh, Defender Antivirus Anti-Malware Platform Update, KB5007651 version 1.0.2303.27001 has resolved the issue. Microsoft also said that this um, update resolved the issue. Now, this update itself currently is almost a bug because every day it's getting reinstalled and I've seen a whole lot of comments um, on the channel regarding this and it's also um, in my case it's also happening and you can see again today it was installed and if I scroll down in my update history for um, these Defender um, updates it's never listed as a update it always gets reinstalled so you can see here it was reinstalled again today now this this in itself says that something is incorrect and something is wrong because that is not normal so that itself is a bug and now if we head over to our windows security app and we head to our device security core isolation and on the core isolation page you can also see now that the local security authority protection section has been removed which is not right now Microsoft could have removed this because I'm seeing a lot of users and viewers of this channel saying that this section, including myself, as you can see it's removed, is no longer there. It's disappeared. Now this could be a bug, um, but I don't think Microsoft would have actually intentionally removed this because this is actually a quite an important security um, kind of aspect of the Windows 11 operating system your local security authority protection as I have posted previously. So this could be a bug. So the fact that this update keeps reappearing and then getting reinstalled from a almost on a daily basis from day to day and the fact that LSA protection has been removed from the core isolation page does tell me that I don't think this is intentional by Microsoft. I still think this is a bug. And once again, and Microsoft has been very quiet on this. They've actually said, as I have posted previously, they have resolved this issue. But I'm still saying otherwise once again. And obviously, I'm keeping a close eye on this. And just wanted to get us all on the same page because um, um, it's very hard for me and difficult for me to try and answer everybody's comment regarding the same issue. So I thought I'd just make one video and get us all on the same page and then obviously, if anything um, does, um, you know, uh, become available where um, Microsoft gives us more info or I get any news or any more info regarding this issue, um, I will post and let you know ASAP. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.